Hi guys, I just went ahead and gathered all of these items. I took them all out of my bags and stuff to get them ready because school is starting soon and I am a first grade teacher. And so I like to create birthday goodie bags for my students. So guys, oh my gosh, here it all is. And I have to get it all done and prepped. Oh my gosh, I feel like there's so much to do, so much to do. And school's starting tomorrow. I don't know, guys. Will I be ready? I don't know. Hi, guys. Welcome back to my channel. And for those of you that are new, I'm glad to have you here today. As many of you know, I am a school teacher. And so during these last couple of weeks of summer, I have been getting lesson plans ready. I have been fixing my classroom up to get it ready for the students. And I've also been doing some last minute prep work just to make life easier for me before school starts. One of the things that I do like to get ready ahead of time is my students' birthday goodie bags. And of course, as a teacher, I try to get it done at an affordable price just because there's so many expenses that we have as teachers. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how I create my students' birthday goodie bags at an affordable price. And so everything here came from either Target's Dollar Spot, otherwise known as their Bullseye's Playground, or from the Dollar Tree, or on clearance that I bought throughout the year. So guys, let's go ahead and begin and see how I create my students' birthday goodie bags. The first item and the most important item is the loot bag or container. Whatever you're using to hold your items, that of course is the most important thing. And so I like to get my loot bags from the Dollar Tree because of course it's only $1 and the ties are included. The one that I selected for this year are the ones with the emojis on them. And I think they're so cute because they're laughing, they're smiling. They just look like they're having fun. And for a birthday, they should be, you know? I want my students to be super excited and happy. So this is what I selected. When you turn it over, you can see the ties right here. And they are wire ties, which I think is so much better because then you don't have to worry about making a bow or it coming apart. And it's just so easy to do. Plus, you don't have to buy it. So for a dollar, I highly suggest getting your loot bags from the Dollar Tree. So here is a look at it outside of the package. And it's super cute. It is double-sided. So here's the front and the back. The next item will be the first thing that I put inside of the goodie bags. And these are Minnie's Cookies. You get this entire box of cookies for a dollar from the Dollar Tree. How awesome is that? And it includes 10 individual packs, which is even better because that means all of these are sealed, which is allowed at my school. And what's cool is that there are so many different flavors in here. You get orange cream, banana cream, vanilla cream, another vanilla cream, and strawberry cream. So... I went ahead and bought two packs of these, which only cost me $2. And here's a look at the individual packs. I went ahead and placed a pack of cookies inside the goodie bag and it is looking nice and full already. So let's continue on. Something I like to include in the students' goodie bags is something to play with. And so I went ahead and bought these eight pack sets of modeling dough from the Dollar Tree, which I'm going to go ahead and separate so that each student can get one each inside of their goodie bags. So I went ahead and opened up the eight pack sets of modeling dough and separated them. And you can see there are eight different colors and it does say modeling dough on the front. So it makes it super cute and the kids will know exactly what's included. I went ahead and placed the dough inside and I purposely made it so that the cover faced forward so that there was color in the bag which makes it even more fun for the students. Another thing that I like to include in the goodie bags are pencils. I know a lot of students have pencils but most of the time they just have the basic yellow number two pencil and so I wanted to get them something fun and colorful and bright that they could have of their own and so I went ahead and bought these colorful pencils from Target's Dollar Spot, otherwise known as their Bullseye's Playground. And they're just so super cute and fun. 
This first set here has a rainbow theme and you get stripes, rainbows, and alphabets. And the second set of pencils have just a lot of positive sayings on here. Things like, oh, let me just go ahead and read them. Build a powerful mind, create positivity, kindness is cool, explore, dream, discover, and be a, what does it say? Oh, be a problem solver. There you go. So just really cute positive sayings or just really cute rainbow designs, which I think is cute for the students. 10 counts of pencils for only a dollar per pack. DPCI is 234-241228. Now you don't have to buy these exact pencils because you can buy them all over the place. You can buy pencils at the Dollar Tree for a dollar per pack. You can find them at Walmart, Target, Big Lots, the 99 cent store, CVS. There's so many places that sell cute pencils. So if you don't have these exact ones, don't feel bad because you can find them all over. I just took them out of the package and they are so cute. Oh my gosh. That alphabet one is so cute. I think I might want to keep one. So I went ahead and placed one of the rainbow striped pencils inside. And I purposely put it towards the middle so that when I cinch up the top, then it'll just be easy for me to go ahead and tie it. Since we read a lot in our classrooms and we expect the students to read a lot at home as well, I like including a bookmark so that they can have it when they're reading to save their pages. And this one is super cute because it has an actual birthday design. It says happy birthday and you get an ice cream cone with sprinkles and a place to put the student's name and date. Now this came from Target's Dollar Spot and it includes a set of 24 bookmarks that all look exactly like this. When you turn it over, it says, you are one incredible, fun, amazing kid. And I love how fun and colorful it is, perfect for boys and girls. And this bookmark set only cost a dollar. The DPCI is 234-241227. Here's a look at the bookmark outside of the package and you can see just how cute it is. I don't normally put their names on here because I just have a whole set of bags. I don't know who's coming or who's going throughout the year. And so this way I can just easily pull any gift bag to give to any student. So here's the goodie bag with the bookmark in here. And I purposely put it towards the side so that you can actually see it. The next item I like to include in the goodie bags are ring pops. I do this every single year just because the students love these. It's like a toy and a candy all in one and they get so excited when they see the ring pops so I just go ahead and include them every single year. And there seem to be different types. I guess this is like the original and this one is sour. This one's freeze. And I'm gonna go ahead and open them because a lot of people have been asking me what's the difference. So let's go ahead and take a look. I went ahead and opened the regular pack, I guess the original, and you can see it's not very mixed. It's really random and you get a lot of the same colors, so you never know. I have one blue raspberry. I have three of the watermelon and four of the strawberry. But that's okay, because the kids seem to love strawberry anyway, so it's all right. This next pack is sours, and we have sour green apple, sour lemonade, and I got two of the sour raspberry, so that's what sours look like. This last one is called freeze, and you have blue raspberry ice, I got two of those, berry punch blizzard, and lemon lime chill i went ahead and placed one of the ring pops inside right on top of the modeling dough just to make it look a lot fuller and it's looking good and finally the last item i like to place inside is an eraser usually i'll place mini erasers in there but this time i think i want to put something a little bigger just because it's a birthday and so i have all of these erasers i got during clearance times or on sale or extras from Valentine's Day or Easter. You know how they have those sets? 
So I think I'm going to randomly choose some and place them inside of the bags just to make it cute. You can see I randomly placed a slice of cake in here. That's an eraser and I thought it was so appropriate just because it is a birthday goodie bag. So there it is, my birthday goodie bag is filled with everything that I want to include in it. Don't forget, if you buy your birthday goodie bags from the Dollar Tree, they do include the twist ties and so all you have to do is peel them off individually like that. I went ahead and tied my goodie bag, but I am not done. I still have one more thing to add on to it. I want to go ahead and include these reward certificates that say happy birthday on them. And these are so cute. These look like gumball machines with gumball in it. It says happy birthday and there's room to put the name and date on there. This comes in a 30 count pack and as soon as I saw it, I knew that I wanted to get it for my students. These are a dollar per pack and the DPCI is 234241226. And in case you're wondering, it is plain on the back. There's nothing on there. And here is a look at the birthday reward certificate outside of the package. And oh my gosh, guys, it is so super cute. I mean, birthdays, gumballs, how awesome is that? Here you go, guys. I went ahead and stapled the certificate onto the goodie bag. And look how cute it is. I cannot wait to give these out to my students for their birthdays. I think they'll love it. I went ahead and turned it over so you can see that on the back it still looks fun and cute and colorful. You can see the bookmark, you can see the ring pop. It's just fun both back and front. It's getting there guys. There's a big mess but we're getting there. And I am done guys. Here are all of the birthday goodie bags that I created for my students. and. I think these are so cute. Oh my gosh. I am in love with these super cute little gumball machine certificates. How adorable are these? I feel like I want to go out and buy some more from Target's Dollar Spot, otherwise known as their Bullseye's Playground, but I have a feeling they're probably already sold out. But that's okay because I know that Target comes out with the cutest things every year and i have no doubt that they'll create even more cute items for birthdays next year so guys this is it i hope that you enjoyed watching me create my birthday goodie bags for my students i hope you like my video i hope that you share it with your friends and if you haven't done so already i hope that you subscribe to my channel thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day, guys.